Tom. I think I'm missing one Jiggy. But I don't remember where it is. Oh no, I'm missing one Jiggy for the flower. Oh god, okay. I still have an urge to climb up the leaves. Let's grab this, let's see what's in here. Might as well, right? There should be another extra life in here somewhere. Isn't that right, game devs? Game devs, I'm not finding my extra life in here. Game devs, you failed me. I'm kid. I kid, of course. Give me that Bokum token. And get me the hell out of here. Alright. Now, how can I get down here safely? You know what, that works. Oh, sweet! I didn't kill myself. Man, you have no idea how worried I was that I was going to die. Uh... Is there anything else I need to do? Like, in, in terms of climbing? Because those leaves are still kind of bugging me. Oh no! Never mind! It just led up here! Oh, is, am, I, is that, am I seeing this correctly? Is that it? That... Yep. Yep, that is it! That's where this led me. So I didn't even have to worry about it. Don't worry about it, I didn't even have to climb up there. I wasted everybody's time, including my own. Never, uh, oh god, never good. Alright. I probably wonder to yourself, Tom! Tom, you dumb! You've yet to get any empty honeycomb pieces. That's a bright ass blue flower. There's only two jiggies left, one of them being the, uh... Oh god, I'm I'm dying. Uh, two jiggies left. One of them being in Winter Land when Israel was in Winter's Land. Let my people go. Um, the other of which being well, one's Jinjo's and one of them is just around Winter Land. There's only one jiggy in Winter Land. I'm assuming Winter Land is where the oh god, I'm being chased by a Dagron fly. Not anymore though. He gave up. He gave up the ghost. Uh. Oh, I could do this. Excuse me, sir. Could you spare one Bokum token? I almost have enough to transform into the bee again. That's how many Mumbo tokens. That's all the Mumbo tokens. Okay. Give me, give me health. I need it. I, wait! I need that to live! That's from an episode of The Simpsons. Where it was a parody on Lord of the Flies. It was a good episode. I liked it a lot. It was like, uh, you got Ralph with his, uh, classic line of, I eat the purple berries. And then him on the ground going, yeah, it tastes like burning. Good episodes of The Simpsons. All right, so here we are in Winter One, Winter What's It Land. Oh, God. All right, there's something I want to do here that's probably going to kill me, but I'm going to save it for the end. Because if I get everything, then it's fine. I don't have to worry about it. There's ice here also. First thing I need to do is take flight. Oh, I said take flight. There we go. Because you got these suckers right here, and they're like, ah, taste my icy ra- Oh god! And they're dead. I'm glad I've got all these extra feathers too, because I was doing this in my practice run, I didn't bother using the codes, because it's like, oh, why bother? And I ran out of feathers many, many a time. Speaking of which, I'm also killing everything I see. Oh, wait, wait, wait. There's the last Jinjo. I'll save him for later. Let me go ahead and kill all these snowmen. The revenge of the dirty snowmen. Oh yeah? How did I miss? What the hell? Where did that snowball go? Oh, come on. There we go. There's like stuff underneath each one of them. I don't know why they constantly give me... Ooh. Wait. Aha! Ah! Bah, you're, you're not dead! There we go, now you're dead. Alright, we're gonna fly around and kill all the, 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 the snowmen. Well, hopefully getting enough notes to complete. To finish to- Ow! You filthy predictor of my moves. Uh-oh! Ooh. 
That was a lot of snowman. I'm, oh god. And bonk. Bonk. There it is. It's eerie. Oh, he's grown. Well, hang on, hang on, baby. I just want to survey the area before I come and get you. Oh, it's so beautiful. All right, we're gonna fly all the way to the top here and see if we can't find that one platform from before and see if this got anything on it. Now, I think, don't quote me on this, I think there is something there. It's probably just an extra life, but let me get something a little bit more, uh, did that branch break off? No, it's right there. All right, is there anything up there? Did I come up here for nothing? Looks like it. All right. Well, at least I've got 50 more feathers to work with. All right, so this is going to be a uh, descent from the top of this area down to the bottom. Because everything we needed to do with the... Whoa, oh, God. Oh, Jesus. Sorry, guy, you all right? Everything we needed to do, we could just do on the way down. Everything we need to do, I should say, we could do on the way down. Oh, no, wait, I remember where both uh, all the honeycomb pieces are. Uh-huh. Ow! Man, these vines grew huge. I probably could destroy them with just a thought and with golden feathers, but still. I could destroy you with just a thought. Said the guy in the military who was hooked up to neural implants that controlled the tank, and he's like, please, don't make me think about hurting you, because I will accidentally hurt you. I, I, that's, I'm not saying that as a threat. I'm saying that as a warning. I could accidentally kill you with a thought. Eerie, mighty eagle at last. Watch me as I fly into the sky. I grow up so fast. Why? Or my son! <laughs> Thank you for everything! You taught me the value of being a parent! And that I never had to change your diaper and all you needed was caterpillars and to sleep! I'll be sure to raise my actual kids just like you! Caterpillars and sleep, no need for bowel uh, movements. I don't know until what age, but they have no need for bowel movements. I miss him already. Fortunately, I got notes to fill the to, to fill the void. Uh, let's see. Eight more. If there's another group of, I see another group of four notes over there. If there's one on the other side of the uh, of the whoop, on the other side, then I should be set. Oh wait. Oh, there's a flight pad over there, and I need that flight pad in order to get the next. Uh, whoa! America's next pop honeycomb piece. Okay. I'm glad these panels don't slip. If they did, that would suck. This is kind of hard to do. Cause you gotta do this. Not that. That, okay, good. And, all right, well, it's easier to land up here and do this. There we go. And while we're up here, what do you think we get? Dude, get out of his nut stash. That's gross. Why are there two enemies in your nut stash, nab nut? Jesus. Nabnut. Nabnut, what kind of party are you throwing here? <gasps> Hello, honeycomb piece. We did it! Oh my god, dude! We only got one more to find. We also have to find notes as well. And I gotta get that last Jinjo as well. There's a few things I gotta do here. Don't judge me, don't rush me. I'm doing my best. I swear to god, if you judge and or rush me, I will not be a happy sailor. Like, okay, so I stream We Fit You on Twitch sometimes. Usually Wednesday, uh, early afternoons, uh, in the, in the Eastern Standard Time. Uh, one thing, oh, this is where the notes are. One thing that I find kind of funny is that I used my, used what I learned in We Fit You with, like, Friction and the Ultimate Obstacle Course to navigate that. No! Okay. This is a bitch to get up. Okay, good. So I got those four notes, there's four more notes on the other side, and I'll have all the notes, and I just gotta get the Jinjo and the Death Honeycomb. Which, good thing I'm saving it for last, because if this was the N64 version, and I had to lose all my notes every time I died, or lose my... Basically, I had to collect all the notes again to be able to get a higher note score. Um, 
then if I got that honeycomb the, at the first thing I did, <clears throat> I would most likely die trying to get out. It is nightmarish. Which is why I'm not going to really worry about it. Because if I die, it's like, uh, it's like Luffy says. If I die while I'm following my dreams, then I die. There's kind of a realistic sense to it because people often die before... That's really depressing. People often die before their dreams are realized, unfortunately. Hopefully, like, you know, it's one of those things where you kind of... <gasps> you found all 100 notes on this world! Well done! Oh, God! Stop saying I need help! I just broke my femur! I just broke my... my... my, uh, hubris. Ugh, my hubris. The bone in my arm. Hey, Numbo's thing is late. Bear win gamer pick to spruce up gamer profile. Nice. Thank you. And I got all ten jiggies! And I got all the notes! And all I'm missing is an empty honeycomb- oh god. Empty honeycomb piece. And one other thing. I just realized I forgot one other thing. Fly to the skies. Butterfly in the sky. I can fly twice as high. So take a look. It's in a book. Switch, switch. I can switch any witch. Take a witch on the switch. Read that switch bone. Right. Ah! Iceman! The Iceman cometh! Jump, jump, jump for joy. Jump for jump for joy. Jumpity jump, jump, jump for joy. <laughs> I don't know why I thought of this, but like, at the time of recording this yesterday... Yes, that's right! Swim under there! Icy water takes double the air! Um, we had a, our, uh, my family had their la Labor Day party here. And, uh, one of the people that was over was, um, our neighbors, their daughter, and, uh, their daughter's, uh, six-year-old son. And, uh, the, uh, six-year-old son... Oh, wait a minute. Cool. I don't usually get visitors in the winter. Alright, um... And the, the neighbor's six-year-old son. And, uh, they were talking about how the kid is, like, really, is relatively technologically advanced. It's like, you know how it is with, like, kids these days. They're raised with, like, tablets and computers. So, like, he knows how to do a lot of stuff with the computer. So he's talking about the fact that he's, um, helping the teacher out with the computer. And, uh, basically it was like, oh, the computer wasn't turning on. And, uh, the reason was, was because the computer wasn't plugged in. And, uh, they're, like, giving him all this praise about, oh, he's so good with computers. And I go to him, and I say to him, so what's your first, uh, programming language gonna be? C++ or, uh, or, or Java? And he just gives me the blankest stare ever. I mean, like, obviously he's not gonna do that because he's six, which is why I said it, but it's, I just kind of found that funny. They just gave me the, like, the most blank stare I've ever seen. I've only seen blanker stares when I make really bad jokes, uh, to my friends in public. So, like, horrible puns, and they just give me that, like, thousand-yard stare. You know the one. All right, so we are done with this level in its entirety, but we're not exactly done as a whole. Because look at that. We got everything in here, but there's something missing. Something that we need. Something in order, in, in order for our 100% completion to truly be complete. And that, my friends, brings us here. Back to springtime. And where the winter ones- EXCUSE ME! I'm trying to make a metaphor here! You're being rude! And where the winter dies, the spring begins. And where there's spring... I mean, probably not for long because of, of natural issues. Where there's spring, there's rebirth. In the form of- oh god! In the form of jumping up on these buds, which is impossible. Because these were not meant to be jumped upon. Not until summer, anyway. And get up here. Is the bird still there? No, all the birds I killed are dead. Oh, man. You don't think it got significantly larger as time went on? It's like those holes got, like, massively huge. Huge holes for birds. Anyway, what I want to do is come over here. Come over to Mumbus Jumbus. Because as you recall, we still have a, a witch switch jiggy to get. 
And we need to be the bee, the bee of spring's rebirth. Buzzy buzz, motherfucker. I love the waddle this guy has. I'm sorry, I'm a very fat bee. Be better off using my wings. I'd be much better off using my wings. Why aren't I using my wings? Oh, because it's hard to control as hell and I can't go down. Alrighty, we got all the jiggies here, all the notes, and finally, we are going to get all the jiggies! All the jiggies in the world sing long. Bop, bop, ba -da -ba -da bop. We did it! That is every single jiggy in Gruntilda's lair. You know what? Even after all that, we are still left with a few extra jiggies. Interesting, isn't it? Alrighty, so... Let's say we head over into this door here. And, uh, figure out what's going down here. Just gonna waddle along and... <gasps> Mumbo magic get weak. Alright, that's fine. And then... <gasps> magic run out. We can't be a B for the rest of the game? I thought it was called Banjo, spelt with a B! And what do we... Next time on Banjo-Kazooie... This.